Hey, good morning, fish heads. How's everybody doing? Happy hump day. It's Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. And we are over at the spray bench because I'm about 85% through an order that's uh, going to be going out. We are living in the world of S Crank Universe today. And that's what I've got to show you guys. Just some sneak peeks at uh, what's going on in the shop. This is the Wildfire Tiger. All of these are available online on the website at www.jekyllbaits.com. Just some cool pieces this morning to show you guys. This is the Molten Lava. Cool eyes. I love the eyes on this one. We're going to get through them as fast as we can. This is the Big Sexy. Fun little S-crank pattern. Extremely effective. My gold citrus pattern. Also extremely effective. Staghorn. One of my favorites. I really like the subtle blues in this. Obviously getting its name from the bone color on the belly up into that burnt sepia and sienna. And then we've got some opaque sky blue in the cheeks and on the tail. Everybody's standard, just in a holographic twist. This is the yellow bellied thread fin holographic One of my faves, one of my go-tos, any lake that I'm fishing, I'm going to throw that. And then we have the Diablo Shad, just the red holographic version of that. Also super effective. I'd say three seasons out of the year. This thing is going to work for you. Does very well when the waters are cooling off. Does very well pre-spawn, but it'll catch pretty much year-round. I'd say it's a three-season for sure. This is the Rayburn Red Fade Craw. It's a very effective craw pattern. And the Diablo Craw. We've got some Jetson Lure Eyes on there. Also holographic really see that and most of these were ordered I think out of the pieces that were ordered there were only a few that were not holographic in this one um, this is the winter gill in a holographic form and in order to really make that holographic image underneath the foiling stand out um, I went just a shade lighter in this one now, believe it or not, there actually is a non S crank in this, and it's the Mad Hatter Craw. This is in the Little John MD50. I love this pattern. And you know what? Red, he, this guy knows that red is a very effective color. And it is. Especially if you're fishing Texas Lakes. The holographic. Lake Charles Shad, Chrome Pop Eyes, Deep Red fading into lighter red, fading into white on the belly. And you can see that holographic veining all throughout the pattern. The Long Eared Sunfish with that purple glitter. And you can see the holographic spotting on the eyes. These are real cool eyes. I think these eyes are actually from Lore Parts Online. I want to say. I could be wrong. I could be extremely wrong on that. I'm going to have to look up and see where the eyes are from. But they're actually a lavender. You get that long fin on the side, that ear flap, down into the fade. The Gray Ghost, another popular pattern. Especially when the shad are dying off. When the shads start dying off in the fall, like we're getting ready to go through, this is an outstanding pattern to use. Just start ripping it, 
letting it sit, rip it, let it sit, rip it, let it sit, and you'll get bit. The Tempest. Now this pattern right here is not online yet. Um, we're going to be throwing this online today, I think, or tomorrow in a holographic pattern. Get that into the light a little bit better for you guys. And these are just out of the clear coat. So we're going to be cleaning these up momentarily. Just a couple more to get through. I think we left off at the Winter Gill. Also holographic. That deep purple. I think there's a band named that. Into that red violet. Some yellow, some flush blue on the cheeks. And some living eyes. And you can see the veining and the 3D imagery, if I can get the camera close enough, on this particular bait. One of the things I love about spraying these patterns is that you can really get that deep, almost a, a 3D image out of just painting. It's not imaged. It's not an imaged bait. Don't make that association. But super cool pattern. And then last but certainly not least, if you guys saw the video trailer, here is the Night King and S-Crank with Jetson Lure Eyes. Man, I love doing these. This is a good bit of work. This is usually about two or three hours just to do this one bait. So that's, that's figured into the pricing online. Now the S-Cranks are not online, but you can find these in popper form on uh, JekyllBaits.com. We might put the S-crank on, see what kind of response we get to it. And there you go, kids. That is your weekly update, midweek hump day. Have a great rest of your week, and I will see you guys on the water.